going on, people? It's your boy Billy Mac. We are back. We are here. Here once again. Another video. I'm just going to get something off my chest. It's my college, by the way. I'm just going to get something off my chest. You know what I don't like? I don't like side chicks, man. I don't like side chicks. And then, and you know what I really don't like? You know what? Let me. I'll take that back. I'll take that back. If you're a side chick and you don't know that you're a side chick, I get it. I get it. Men are perpetrators. They're horrible. I get it. I'm all, I'm with you on that. With you on that, boo. You 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 you, you do what you got to do. Cause that nigga's trifling. I I feel you. But it's the side chicks that know they side chicks. Y'all are ruining it for a lot of women out here. I just want y'all to know that. Y'all are ruining it for for a lot of win, women out here. Y'all are really, really, like, making things horrible for a lot of women out here. I just want y'all to know that, okay? Just, just putting that out there. I don't want y'all to know that. Y'all are really making it bad for a lot of women out on these streets. You know what I mean? So, with that said, Welcome to Mycology. The, 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 um, what's the word? The, not the myth, the legend of the side chick. So, one thing, especially, I want to talk, by the way, original, you know, we, I got an idea for something. Cause, cause. I always wondered, I, I, I see the Me Too movement, you know, I see the the feminist movement, I'm a feminist by the way, uh, for those that don't know, I see all these things about empowering women and all this out here. My issue is, when, when did, it, why, why isn't an issue now? What happened Back in the day, what happened back in the day for us to get to a point where we look at women as less than? That's the question I want to know. I want to know when, where was that threshold? Was it, was it a gradual decline or was it, it was pretty equal and then it just dropped like what? You know, I you know, I want to dive into that because now we have this this wonderful thing called a side chick. Now, back in the day, a side chick was just a chick you was cheating on your girl with. That's all she was. Nah, this just I'm just cheating. No, this you know, you know. But these Negroes out here have gone to a whole nother level. Not only, not only is this the girl you cheating on, but you buying her things, y'all hanging out in public, like, you know, like she actually has some status in your life and you're doing all of this without your girl and or wife knowing about it, bro. This some ne this some next level cheating right here, especially in the social media age. Like, yo, come on, man, really, really. And then, then not only that, like I said, I can understand if she don't know she the side chick, but then you got the side chicks that know they the side chick. Like, I don't like. Okay, if you sit here and tell me. If you sit here and tell me the reason you a side chick is because you don't want to be in a relationship, but you want the perks that come with a relationship. Okay, that's fine. That's that's fine. I get okay. You basically you want friends with benefits. And I mean that's every man's dream. Friends with ben friends with benefits? What? You mean to tell me we can have sex as often as we want and we're not obligated to each other? What? <laughs> hey, 
great. That's one of the greatest things ever. I can't even. I can't even lie about that one. But but wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. So you clearly are the side chick, and you clearly are the side chick, and you want some obligation to this Negro. No, shouting. You want to be that nigga's girl. And you want to be his girlfriend. You don't want to be a side chick. You want to be his girlfriend. And don't you dare act like you you fine with the side chick title. Don't don't give me this whole. Well, he got a wife and he got a kids and that's fine and everything. But he just better make sure he he got what I need. Wait a minute. Wait. Whoa. No. 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 Listen. Like I said, I am a feminist all day long. I believe anything a man can get, a woman can get all day long. But uh, um, if you're the side chick, you're only getting side chick privileges. For example... If I'm going on vacation with my wife and my family, madam, you get no calls. You get no texts. You get no response until I get back in town. That's side chick. That's, <laughs> that's side chick rule number one. Side chick rule number two. You, if, if you must get in touch with me. You know there is, at least for the men, if you're smart about this, there should be there should only be one form of communication. That is the only form of communication you can use to get in touch with me. If you use any other form of communication to get at me, to where my wife can find out, you have officially been cut off from side chick privileges. Do you understand what I'm saying? It like like these chicks just be calling I'm in bed with my wife and you just calling me in the middle of the night I need you to do something for me no you are not my girlfriend you are a side chick do you hear me side chick rule number three there is information that you are privy to but you're not privy to all the information. I might come to you and vent to you about my wife and my kids. But that's about it. I'm not coming to you to vent to my about to vent to you about my job. The only reason you are side chick is because you provide a service that I am getting for free. So therefore, you are only privy to the information that I give you. Don't get it twisted. You are not my girlfriend. You are a side chick. Like, 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 this is... Now, I want to make one thing clear. I don't have side chicks. I don't do side chicks. If you watch my last video, like I told you, I couldn't even date multiple women. Let alone have a side chick. You know what I'm saying? A lot of dudes had that little black book. You know what the little black book is. If you don't know what the little black black blah, blah, blah. you don't know what the little black book is, ladies. That is a book with a list of numbers. And in that book are the list of numbers that of females. When it's let's just say two, three, four o'clock in the morning, there's only one thing that's on our mind. And we go to that little black book and we look through it. And it's like, I ain't talked to her in a while. Let me talk, see what she's doing. Bring, hello. Hello. Hey, what's up? Yo, what's up? It's B. What, what you doing? I'm asleep. I gotta go to work in the morning. Oh, well, my bad. My bad. I, you know, I'll talk to you later. Wait, wait. I mean, what you trying to do? I mean, you know what, you know, you know what it is. All right, come on. Side chick mentality. No, my, I should have said that like Mortal Kombat. Side chick mentality. <laughs> Yo, man. 
I ain't got much to say. I ain't got much more to say on this. I'm gonna make another video about this. I'm, I might go. I might go in depth into the actual psychology of the side chick. But for all you women out there, for all you women out there who are side chicks, and you know you're a side chick, and you're actually okay with being a side chick, I just want you to understand you're one of the reasons, not the re not the reason, but you're definitely one of the reasons why men treat women the way that they do. You're definitely one of the reasons. Because you're, I mean, you, you make it easy for us. You make it easy for us. I, I would be lying. I would be lying. I would be lying if I said sex wasn't an important part of my relationship when I got married. I, I'd be lying bold face to y'all. Straight up. I it's, And it's not even close. But you mean to tell me there are women out here just giving it up for free? And all I got to do is act like I like them? Yo. Side chick. But anyway. I don't care. Listen, I probably not offend. I probably have offended a lot of women out there. I really don't care. You chose that lifestyle. I only want better for you. There's a nigga out there that wants you. Now, granny, he might not have money. Now, granny, he might not be the prettiest nigga on the planet. Now, granny, he might not be doing anything with his life right now. But, I mean, would you rather be the side chick? Or would you rather be his queen? I'm just, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. You know, because everybody, everybody, listen, if you ain't seen coming to America, God bless you. But everybody knows that that wonderful scene, very beginning of the movie, very beginning of the movie. You know, Hakeem, they might be his servants. But in 2018, we all know those are his side chicks. The royal penis is clean, your highness. All day long. Anyway, it's your boy Billy Mac. Shout out to Original, my family and friends, my wife. Love y'all, my daughter. I don't think I've ever shot out my daughter. Love you, Lael. Uh, please like, subscribe, share, comment. It's your boy. Holla and uh, pay.